Assalamu alaikum, lots and lots of love uh, and uh, you know welcome to another video up in Shani's world, up in Samira's world, the Shani world uh, and uh, yeah you know what, hope you guys are doing awesome. Samira is just doing the honours of putting some rice and some kofte for Fufu. Uh, he's gonna have three kofte and some rice, he's loading up, he's trying to eat you know quite as much as possible to gain that weight. Uh, and next up what we're gonna do is me and Samira is gonna be getting busy to uh, make a tava kima. It's going to be awesome. Everyone's really looking forward to it. I'm really looking forward to it as well. And Roshni is really looking forward to it as well. So, uh, you know what? We're not going to waste any more time. We're going to get straight into it. And let's go make some wonderful Tava Kima. Chalo ji. Land hai, Jamal? Chalo ji. Acha, aap piyaz te mircha. Te kima bhi. Te acha, piyaz nahi, piyaz nahi. Oh, taniya te nahi. Chika nahi. There we go. There we go. So we've got fresh coriander, we've got your kima right here, we've got piaz and mirchan right over here, and we've got some wonderful tomatoes as well. So like I said, let's not waste time. Let's make this tava kima, guys. Come and join us. There we are, the preps are being done. So uh, Samira's cutting the tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. And then we got some fresh coriander to cut yet as well. Um, but ma'am masala they are rak litane. So as you can see right in front of you, you got namak. Uh, I think it was one, one teaspoon, one and a half teaspoon of uh, you know Himalayan salt. Uh, I've got some red chili powder here, one teaspoon. I've got some haldi here, quarter teaspoon. Garam masala, one teaspoon. One teaspoon of coriander powder. Uh, I think half a teaspoon of black pepper and then half a teaspoon of zero powder as well. Oh, and uh, not to forget the chili flakes, one teaspoon. What you see in front as well, I'll just quickly go through it. So we've got two tomatoes chopped as uh, Samira's done right there. You've got garlic and ginger paste. You've got uh, fresh cut coriander. You've got green peas. This right here is uh, green chilies and onions grinded together. And then you've got olive oil and you've got some yogurt as well. So all these ingredients you see right in front are going to be going into the tava kima. And I'm telling you now, it's going to come out absolutely awesome. How excited are you to make this tava kima out of 10? 10. 10. She's really looking forward to making this tava kima. We've made it before. It turned out so, so good. Mashallah, we're going to do it again. Uh, we're gonna, we've changed it a little. Uh, obviously, before when we made the tava kima in the past, we've not added things like yogurt and stuff like that in there. Uh, we're going to try it slightly different. Hopefully, it's going to come out absolutely amazing. But really looking forward to it, guys. So, like I said, we're not going to waste any more time now. Shuru Yeah. Let's go. High five to that. Okay, so you're putting your uh, surgery gloves on. What's uh, with the gloves? What's happening I first step? I'm mixing the kima and like the piaz and the mirch. Okay, so mix, mix it all together. Fair enough. So guys, uh, yeah, this piaz and mircha right over here. I'll place right over there for Samira because that's going to go into the kima. We're going to mix it all together and then we're ready. <laughs> You're looking for it. I'll put it there for you. Thank you. I'm going to mix that. Yeah, Oh, I'm sure a lot of people are going to be asking how much ghee we actually so used. used. We are using about, I would say, a kilo. Yeah, so that's about one kilo worth of ghee, guys. So that's, uh, so that's uh, if you're going to make one kilo worth of ghee, that's the ingredients that I mentioned to you. That's what you want to be using. So, okay, that's done. The other? Jodo. Next step is put the chula on. Uh, let the tava heat up a little bit. And then the first thing you're going to be adding is the olive oil as well as the garlic ginger paste. So let's go. There we are. Get that olive oil on the tava. Right, we're just waiting for the oil to heat up uh, and then we're gonna add that garlic ginger paste. Garlic ginger paste. Chalo ji. Ki da kamal. And once the kima turns white and stuff and it's nicely cooked, then you're going to be adding tomatoes and the masala.
There you go, Samira. There's your tomatoes. I'll put them right over there for you. Beautiful. Right then, what's the next step, love? The next step is to add in the masala. So the masala right behind you. Okay, uh, are you going to be adding the masala and is there anything else that you need to add? Dengue. Dengue as well. So she's going to be adding the masala and the yogurt right there as well. There we are. Sprinkle all the masala, all that powder you had, mm -hmm. straight in. Wow. And then last but not least, you want to add that thing and then whiz it all up there we are so that's the next step guys you want to get that beautiful green peas on there just adds to the color and the taste and everything. Wow. Right, last but not least, Samira, right over there is some fresh cut coriander. That look good. Okay. Tell you what we're gonna do as always. We're gonna finish, not finish the vlog up here, but we're gonna kind of take a step back now the kima is almost ready we will meet you once the presentation is done and i know a lot of you people have requested a certain something when we make our recipes when samira and me are in the kitchen where we're cooking up and stuff uh what you people have requested is that we never do a taste check at the end oh yeah yeah we never do a taste check at the end so you know what in this particular video once the kima presentation is done i'm gonna definitely do a taste check for you as well as samira so come and join us There we are guys, mashallah the kima has come out so so good, so you know what, hats off Samira, you've done a wonderful wonderful no, no, job no. mashallah. We did that. <laughs> oh bless her. Um, I've got to say, a lot of you requested that we take a test, so you know what, Samira do the first honours please. In fact, we'll do it together. Ready? Bismillah rahman rahim garam garam. Oh, that is so good. Right. I'm not just saying it, honest to God, guys. The taste, the flavor is so, so good. We kept the spice slightly down. Slightly down, yeah. Which is good because obviously we want mama, papa, everyone to enjoy. I know we love our spice, but we had to kind of cut back a, a bit. But that with garam garam roti or even white rice would go perfectly. So, good. so you know what, guys? We're going to finish it off here. Thank you for joining us. Make this at home. Let us know, you know what you think of it. But until then... Until the next uh, recipe and the next video, it's going to be Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz.